how to be an animagus. How to be an animagus. Yeah, it's not even an easy thing. You just think you just drink like uh funny how I've been wondering that, Loki. You think you just drink uh like a, a, portion. a portion and to get that portion is process is long. So okay. Before you get into the why do people become animagus? It's just part of being it, it's not like like a must. I think my friend was telling me they're like just only four registered animagus or so I can't really remember. Mm. So it's just something it's just been you know, added mm. something to your magic. But yeah, yeah, but it's it's actually a whole process. It's not really even easy. Like when I was reading what put out, I was like, I see, I'm not sure I would do this. <laughs> yeah. So like the first step to becoming an amigos mm. was that the witch or wizard in question had to keep a single mandrake leaf in their mouth for an entire month. Eh, eh. From full moon to full moon, if the leaf was removed or swallowed, then the witch or wizard will have to start all over again. Jesus. At the next visible full moon, if the night happened to be cloudy, one would have to start over. The wizard had to spit... Wait, hold leaf. up, hold up, hold up. That one is entirely out of your control. <laughs> yeah, I'm telling you. <laughs> aye, aye, aye. The wizard had to spit the leaf into a fell within range of the moon's pure rays. So the moon struck fell, the wizard or witch must add one of their own hairs, a silver teaspoon of dew that had not seen sunlight or been touched by human feet for seven days, and a chrysalis of a death's head hawk moth. The resulting mixture then had to be put in a quiet, dark place and could not be disturbed in any way. Hmm. The next thing that the next thing that had to happen was for the wizard to wait for an electrical storm whenever that might be. <laughs> During this waiting period, the wizard would have to, at sunrise and sundown, every every day without fail, chant the incantation Amato Animo anime, Animato Animagos with the tip of their wand placed over the heart. When at last there was a lightning storm, the wizard had to move immediately to a large and secure place, recite the incantation one final time, and then drink the animagus portion. Now, note that this is very difficult to do. It's like a PhD, man. <laughs> it's very difficult to do, but Sirius Black and James Potter, Harry Potter's father, they did it at a young age. They were legends for doing that. Yeah. Jigets. Mm. It's not easy to, but somehow they pulled it off. Yeah. Thumbs up to That's them. That's crazy, man. It's wild. Like, it's, it's a whole freaking PhD. 